friendlies, it's Carolyn and welcome back to my real RV life. It is Thursday morning and I just wanted to do, hey there's Capone. I'm trying something new with a tripod here, kind of a selfie stick. <laughs> anyway, I wanted to give you an update because I'm going to be posting a video either later today or tomorrow about tips and tricks on how to deal with a breakdown, since that seems to be something I'm kind of an expert at. Um, but it was shot on Sunday, so it's got a little outdated information. And uh, for those of you who do follow my videos as I post them, I didn't want you to be totally confused because in there it says um, my transmission needs to be rebuilt and all kinds of stuff. So uh, just a heads up, my transmission did not have to be rebuilt and I'm free. I am free. Okay, hold on. Listen. You hear that? That's the sound of beauty right there. I'm back home in my element. All right, couple quick updates. The rig is done. She's done. She's fixed. She's running amazing. Oh my gosh, I have a first and a second gear now, which I never realized I didn't have before, ever, I don't think. So she's shifting great. She's running really smooth. The brakes are great. It ended up costing me $1,100 to get the brakes done. I needed everything in the front had to be completely redone. New pads, new rotors, new calipers, everything had to be redone. He had to do a couple things on the back uh, so yeah the brakes were a mess I've got video of all of that I show the cracked brake for those of you who don't believe me um, and that's I'm gonna do all of that in a different video I left uh, Team Ramco in Yuma yesterday. Flash is the man. I, I did an interview with him, and I did um, an interview with his torque converter specialist, Bear, which I will be doing shortly. I have a lot of really great information in that video for gearheads and people maybe who just want to learn a little bit about some of the things that I have learned along the way. So stay tuned. That's going to take a lot of editing. I hope to get to it maybe in the next couple of weeks, but that will be coming soon. And in the meantime, I'm trying to show you my views I'm hope I'm not making you too dizzy all right so that's it eleven hundred dollars uh, you know I just can't get ahead <laughs> but all the transmission work was billed to Harper Automotive I want to make that clear people don't comment if you're not gonna watch the whole video okay I said before he honored the warranty he did not screw me over. He's not a crook. <laughs> I spent two weeks with this guy. He's a very good guy. And even though my transmission was not covered on Napa, even if it needed to be rebuilt, he was going to cover it for me. So he is a good guy. I just want to make that clear. My gosh, people. <laughs> um, so the it, it was about $500 worth of work that needed to be done on the transmission, and he paid for it. So the transmission's running great. The brakes are running great. Matilda's running great. And here I am, um, is, I was set free at four o'clock yesterday. I drove for about two hours due east, <laughs> just any place quiet. I got here, um, got here last night and literally just set up and um, fed Capone and went to bed at 7.30. The second update is about the RTR. I'm going to be there in a few days. I, I don't know when yet. I need a couple days to just kind of get my head on <laughs> after being, after all the stress and um, being in that really busy place surrounded by people. I need to recoup. I'm an introvert. And uh, so this is, I need to recharge before I go face that crowd. I'm looking forward to meeting you guys there. And I think what I'm going to do is a couple of meet and greets at my rig and stay tuned for that. I'll make some announcements on when they are so that we can just sit down and get to know one another um, in a group and get to know the friendly community how does that sound okay so I'm free I got out I think 10 days it was total or nine days total I'm back on the road I'm back in my element oh I'm happy I got to lay in bed and watch the moon rise last night through my window and I've got peace and quiet solitude there are a few other boondockers out here but they're far enough away life is very good Thanks for hanging with me through everything. I love you guys. I will talk to you very soon. And in the meantime, be happy, be free, and be kind. She get me out of here. Wanna see? All right, there's Matilda. Happy, healthy Matilda.